Hi there, welcome to Nepi Invest. So, early Christmas present for Brainship shareholders. Potentially, I think this is potential massive news. It, it is potential company making news and very exciting times for Brainship shareholders and the company itself. So let's get stuck into this potential massive news. So trading in uh, brain chip shares were sort of normal. They began normally at uh, 10, 10 a.m. or just after 10 a.m. Then at 10.07, there was a pause in trading. And so typically a pause in trading, which is released by the ASX, just means there's going to be a trading halt being released to the market in 10 to 15 minutes. And who knows what that trading halt entails. It could be a capital raising or it could be something really significant uh, like a profit guidance or upgrade in profits. But since uh, Brainship doesn't have any revenue, that's probably not what's going to happen. Or optimistically, it's going to be some sort of really positive news. So you don't know until the trading halt is released to the market. So more than likely, Brainship shareholders at 10.07 or just after 10.07 were just hitting the refresh button on their ASX announcement page, just waiting for the trading hold and the reason for the trading hold, which you would get in the trading hold. So then at 10.20 a.m., the trading hold was released to the market. Now, typically the trading hold comes in two pages. First page is the release from the ASX. Uh, and there's no news in that uh, first page. So sometimes uh, the investors just see that first page and the speculation is rife about what the trading hold's about. So they don't realize there is a second page to the trading halt. But before I get to that first, so that second page. So the first page is just mentioning that uh, the brain chip sh shares are gonna be in the trading halt up until the earlier of Thursday the 24th of December or when the announcement from brain chip is released to the market. And that could be literally any time between now and Thursday the 24th of December or commencement of trading on that day. Um, I think the most likely time, if it's not released on the morning of the Thursday the 24th, will be on the morning of the 23rd. But it could be released uh, within the next few hours, it could be released at the end of trading today, or it could be released at the commencement of trading tomorrow. So just keep an eye on the, the, mark, the announcement page, just keep an eye on, on the release of this announcement. So to get the reason for the trading halt, typically you have to get to the second page, and that is the company announcement, the reason for the for the trading halt. And you just have to dig in, not much, and this is the little snippet from that page where it mentions a material customer contract. And this is what Brainship shareholders have been waiting for, news about a material customer contract. One of the things brain chip bears just keep on harping about is the lack of revenue, the lack of any cash flow into brain chip, especially because the brain chip market cap at the moment is about 500 million. So brain chip and their shareholders are needing this sort of news about material customer contracts. Now my one hope is that it is material. So my definition of material may be different from the uh, management's uh, definition of material. So my definition of material is company defining material. So that could be multi-million dollar contract, uh, tens of million dollars contracts potentially. So I'm hoping it's not like $100,000. If that's uh, the numbers they come out with, uh, that would be actually quite disappointing. In fact, I do want numbers. So I'm hoping they do have numbers. Uh, there is a potential that they don't even release numbers because it is uh, sensitive to the company that uh, they have the contract with. Now, the reason why I think it could be significant and company changing is if you go to the Appendix 4C, they do list some of the agreements they have with some companies. And you can see some of these companies are significant companies or organizations. The Ford Motor Company, NASA, these are massive organizations, well-regarded organizations around the world. And this, this material customer contract is with a massive, well-renowned company in the world. This could be company defining, company changing, it could be the inflection point for brain chip and its shares and its shareholders moving forward. So really excited to see what this announcement is, even though I'm not a shareholder of brain chip, I'm still very excited about this announcement. Now, the next thing I'll just look at is shares and how it's been doing over the last six months or so. 
we see a massive rise in shares between 10 and 90 cents in July and August. So the market was getting really excited about the potential of brain chip even back then. But usually when I see that exponential rise in share price over a very short period of time, I do get a little bit wary about buying in because typically after this exponential growth in share price, you always see profit taking, always see the shares retreat back to a level. And what I usually wait for is the shares to start trading between you know, range. We're definitely starting to see that. We start to see the share price consolidating within that range. And we also see the volume of shares pull back. And that means the day traders are pulling out of the uh, trading of brain chip shares. So I've been waiting for a time to enter brain chip. And the time I've been waiting for isn't a sort of a share price. It's sort of an announcement of uh, release of an announcement, just like potentially we're going to see. Uh, in the next few days. So over the last two months, we've seen that share price consolidate. Uh, the last few days, we've actually seen the share price go from 35 to 31 cents. So it has been this very small sell-off in the last three trading days. And hopefully that hasn't been long-term shareholders uh, getting frustrated and selling out. This would have been the worst timing possible. So this could be the announcement that makes me enter, especially if the announcement is significant. So I'm going to wait for this announcement before, you know, I, well, I can't buy it before then because no one can buy or sell shares before. But I'm just going to wait for the announcement, see how the market reacts, and then potentially buy the few days subsequent to the release of the announcement. So this could be the announcement for me to enter into Brainship. So that's all I've got on this announcement for Brainship, this material customer contract. Really exciting times for Brainship and their shareholders. Let's hope the, the announcement is material, the contract is material. And because I'm excited about this company, I think this has a lot of potential. And if it is you know, material, I will enter in. Now, I'm not a financial advisor, so anything I've said here, don't take it as advice. I'm just doing these videos for educational, entertainment, and research purposes. And if you do need advice uh, in regards to your finances, make sure you seek out someone who is qualified and can speak to your own financial circumstances. So that's all for this video. Hope you have a good day. Hope you get an early Christmas present if you're a brain chip shareholder. And that's all for today. Happy New Year's for those who won't see another video of mine for the next seven days or so, eight days, nine days, whatever. And that's all for today. Have a good day. Bye.